Yo, what is going on my dudes? It's Epic here and welcome back to a new video on the channel and in this video guys We're going to be taking a look at a Vlad of Assault Rifle known as the Web Slinger Now this is one of the newest weapons which was added in with the Guardian Takedown Which if you don't know just got its balancing patch to make the enemies and not feel like you're shooting at a walking tank So that's that's all good and fine But the reason why we're actually taking a look at the Web Slinger today is because this gun is seriously under Underwhelming and underpowered and needs a buff as soon as possible and I'm going to show you in this video what it's like But first of all some information about the web slinger So the web slinger is a Vladov assault rifle coming in the fire shock corrosive and radiation elements And it drops from scorch the invincible martyr in minos prime This is of course the guardian takedown the final boss of the guardian takedown and this gun is pretty unique In fact, it's one of the most unique guns I've seen in Borderlands 3 to date, but unfortunately the damage just isn't as special. So what makes this gun unique is that the projectiles you fire will actually fire in the style of webs being shot out of the gun, as this is a Spider-Man Easter egg sort of weapon, so as you can see it fires in like a, a web kind of a formation like that. And the projectiles will also alternate between the base element and the cryo element as well, which means you don't even need sentinel cryo on it like I do. What's also cool about the web slinger is that the projectiles Tiles also ricochet off of surfaces allowing you to hit multiple enemies and it also features an alternate firing mode which in this case is an underbarrel launcher and it always is it just you know you charge it up and then bang you fire it like that but I think that's enough talking let's get right into the gameplay test we are here on mayhem 10 in Athenus I have got my guardian rank enabled and I am on mayhem 10 with big kick healy avenger chain gun and buddy system now again this is a sentinel cryo web slinger and I'm also using the shock and corrosive extra elements from my Zane build but without further ado let's get right into it and see how the gun does so yeah as you can see with extra elements this thing is pretty garbage yeah, I mean, honestly, this thing is just not that good at all, and I know everybody already knows that, but I wanted to make a video on the gun because we actually got a pretty interesting update on Twitter last night from one of the devs who actually worked on this gun. Basically, in a nutshell, it has been confirmed that the Web Slinger is going to be getting buffed in the future, making it actually viable for endgame. So if you have one of these things and it's really, really good, do not get rid of it. Just store it in your vault and wait for them to buff it. I just thought that was a very important thing thing to point out since everyone right now is on the fence with this thing saying that it sucks but do not worry because it is due to get a well-deserved buff in the future and rightfully so I mean you can already see here against Tron it's just absolutely terrible I mean really this is with extra elements too and yeah it's just not good I'm really getting tired of this gearbox always add new weapons and they constantly seem as though all of them are just bad it's almost like they haven't QA tested them for endgame and I, I just I'm getting really tired of it especially like if you're gonna go through a takedown and you're gonna go through the whole thing take out the boss right at the end especially on mayhem 10 you should get a gun that can run the takedown with ease and this thing can barely kill Tron with ease but yeah luckily this weapon is going to get buffed so do not fear guys because it will be getting a buff I don't know when maybe it will be in the second half of the balancing who knows but you know when that happens I will let you guys know and probably revisit this gun in another video but that's basically going to do it for my video on the web slinger now a bunch of you may have noticed that i already did have a guide up on this weapon but i removed it on the same day in a nutshell i just felt like that video was very poorly made and very lazily made as well and i just don't think it was the quality you guys deserved especially considering i left out a lot of information i was actually just really sick at the time and really tired as well and i just thought maybe if i push the video out it would be fine but it was not and I just decided it would be better to come back to it in a few days So I do apologize to you guys for that But I have a way of making it up to you and that is to double the size of your dick skin by allowing you to come and watch me live stream on Twitch at epic NNG So yeah, if thick dick skin is your thing then you're gonna want to come and check me out twitch.tv forward slash epic NNG Where we do stream numerous times during the week But with that being said you guys that's going to do it for my guide on the web slinger again This is a Vladov assault rifle drop Dropping from Scourge the Invincible Martyr in the Guardian Takedown Takedown. But with all that being said, I do hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you're taking care and keeping safe as always. And on that note, have a nice day.